Hello people. Today I'm going to talk about the infamous Y2K bug, also known as Millennium Bug, and its impact on the world and especially on India. As it turned out to be a godsend for Indian tech industry. To know more about how it shaped Indian outsourcing industry. Let's get into it. How a bug brought tech jobs to India. The term Y2K is short for, year 2000, where K stands for Kilo, which is the SI prefix for thousand. It all started in the mid to late 1990s, when people realized that most of the computer software were using only two digits to represent the year. This was not a problem back then, as computers were not around for long, so whenever they wanted to represent the year they just used the last two digits, and prefixed 19 to the number. This was all fine for the 1900s, but as we inch closer to the 21st century, this method cannot be used anymore. As it was found that if we continue to use the two digits to represent the year 2000, then it will cause all sorts of unexpected behavior in computer. Or even worse, some suggested that the entire computer system might fail at the turn of the century. After the potential of possible failure at such a large scale come to light the government of the United States passed the 2000 Information and Readiness Act. To make sure that every major and critical system would be updated in order to minimize or completely eliminate the effect of Y2K bug. These efforts were coordinated by the President's Council led by John Kaskinen. They wanted to make computer system Y2K compliant before the end of the 20th century. But the task to make every system Y2K compliant was no easy feat. It required a large number of programmers and software engineers to go through the codes that were written decades earlier and find the vulnerabilities and fix them manually. This was a laborious work and require lots of people to do it, and that is where India came into play. During the 1990s, India was a new player in the tech field. But the opportunity came at the right moment for both the Indian software engineers and the Indian tech industry. By having such a large population of people who could work on the Y2K problem India became the primary choice for foreign companies to outsource the work to. At the time, the biggest tech industry in India was in Hyderabad, as the giants like Microsoft had their regional office there. So, it came as no surprise that most of the people who worked at Y2K problem were from Hyderabad. The focus on this one specific bug was so high that in 1998, Y2K contracts accounted for 23% of the total Indian software exports. In the end the Y2K bug was not turned into the doomsday as predicted by some folks. And it is still argued that whether the amount of $300 billion that was spent to fix the bug was justified or not. But one thing we all can say for certain is that, the Y2K does not only cemented India's image as a country which provide IT services to the entire world but also helped develop the BPO industry in India. Thanks for watching, if you like this video hit like and subscribe for more and don't forget to ring the bell icon, I will be back with another interesting video next week, until then stay curious.